Yo, what is up guys? This is Palette Flipper 17 here, and guys, today we're going to be opening my first ever liquidation, I guess, palette, but this is actually a case. It's from Bulk.com because there's no liquidation factories or warehouses near my area. So let's go ahead and get into this. Um, I, however, did not look at the manifest, so most of this stuff, actually not even most, all of it, other than what I could see on the pictures, is pretty much brand new. Uh, as far as that goes, so. Alright, it's very hard to open boxes one-handed. I can, uh, I can already tell that. Um, but this will be the first ever video onside this channel. Jesus, this box is... There we go. But no, so this will be the first ever video onside this channel. Let me prop this up just a little bit here. One second. Alright. Looks already like we might have something of interest there. I got a sneak little peek of the inside. I know they never, I know they say to never cut towards yourself, but that's exactly what I just did. All right, well, we are officially inside of our first ever liquidation palette, and boy, am I nervous. All right, let's see what we got here. Now, all these items inside the palette were brand new, or at least should be. It looks like we got some factory damage here, which is probably why they were returned. We have a Softworks salad spinner. Um, I don't really know how much these items are worth, but I would probably say... I've never heard of this, so I'm going to say maybe like $10, $15 maybe. I've never heard of a salad spinner. All right, so... Um, oh, this looks interesting. What do we got here? Um, a snow globe snow tube. Interesting. So it looks like some sort of inflatable thing. Uh, maybe like 10 bucks with that. Filled with snow. So yeah, maybe like 10 bucks. Um, let's see. What is this? This... Ooh, sharper image. Okay, usually sharper image items are... Um, they're kind of like the as seen on TV products, but battery operated. Looks like maybe some sort of light or something. Yeah, mercury, mercury glass orb LED string light. Probably about ten bucks. Um, uh oh, we got some trash bags. What? Okay, this is very intriguing. So we have trash bags, like literally a big roll of trash bags. So. Put those there. Um, yeah, and then just an extra trash bag laying around. Cool. So we got some up and up trash bags. Um, looks like we have a DEET free insect repellent. Looks like it was on clearance. Probably just didn't sell at the store. Um, here we have. Opal House LED fairy lights. And I like those little lights. Look at that. That's pretty neat. So, probably about five, ten bucks for that. Um, here we have a command brand damage free hanging uh, picture hanging strips. Large ones. Um, I actually buy these quite often for the pictures around the house and stuff. Uh, so, about. Four dollars there. Not bad. We got a few more here. Um, three shelf hanging closet organizer by Threshold. Uh, this is probably about a five, ten, maybe fifteen dollar item. All items have been brand new so far. So, what is this? Grid paper. Probably like a buck. Oh, now this is interesting. So it's a jumbo snow bunker. And, uh, well, my state doesn't see snow often, so this will probably be like maybe $10 at the best. Uh, what do we got here? We have a master lock security lock, it looks like. So it's like a bike lock. Oh, and then we have another command picture strip. 
Neat. Okay, so, yeah. Um, another dollar from the command strip, and then probably about five bucks for the master lock, like lock. Um, a few more command strips. Um, another command. Seems like we got a lot of command items in this. Maybe they don't. Uh, it's a damage free hanging thing and it's metal, so excuse the noises in the background, guys. My bad. Uh, let's see what else we got. Some Scotch Expressions masking tape. Interesting. So, probably about like $3 there, maybe. Let's see. Oh, no. It was $2.99, now it's $1.48. So, if we take the clearance sticker off, maybe 2 bucks. Looks like we got some napkins. Don't really understand that, but hey, household items, right? Go with the trash bags over here. And we got another command thing. Alright, let's see. We got more of these napkins. I don't know why we have napkins in here, but hey, it's party time. <laughs> it's our first ones. So, yeah. Um, let's see. What else we got in this little cutie? So, we got a more, another command strip. It looks like we got a lot of command strips out of this, honestly. Yep, another command strip. These are about a dollar a piece. And, ooh, okay, so we got some eucalyptus oil. Interesting. Probably about uh, five, six dollars for that. It's an essential oil. Those are usually going pretty high dollar these days. Um, oh, we got some more of these Opal House LED fairy lights. Interesting. Probably about, like I said earlier, five dollars for those. Um... Jesus, man, the amount of command in this box is just crazy. That's all command. More command. And there's just a lot of command items in this box. Look at that. That's like at least a dollar a piece there. Um, dollar a piece. Right now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to sell these at uh, flea markets. Oh, uh, okay, cool. So we have a suede um, care kit by Kiwi. Uh, it looks like it was a little bit opened maybe but I mean it's still brand new it hasn't been used it's just the ceiling on it kind of broke I guess at the store that it was at or wherever so it came from um two more boxes of these candle lights these will be about five bucks so um what do we got here a 15 foot Westinghouse power indoor extension cord huh not bad. Probably about a five dollar item there. Five, ten bucks. And these guys, you know, this is my first time doing this, so the pricing is definitely going to be way off. But yeah, um, these are all a dollar, it looks like. Yeah, a dollar. Um, interesting. Another dollar. <laughs> wow, that's crazy. Alright, and we got a few bigger items in here. What is this? Oh, we got some scotch felt pads for, like, furniture. Like, you got, like, a hardwood floor, you know? You got some metal ends on your furniture. You don't want to scratch up that nice hardwood flooring. Now, what do we got here? These are storage, room essential storage bins. Not bad at all. Look to be brand new, as they should be. So, we'll set those, I guess, down here. Um, we got a few of these bins here too, which will probably be what we use to sell to flea mar at the flea market. Um, just to put all this small stuff in. So, and it looks like we're just going to finish this off. Oh, what is this? And that's nothing. Oh, that was for the napkins. That was the napkin bag, so I guess that uh, was open somewhere. But yeah, so there's that. Not bad at all for our first box. Let's move on to the next box. And in the next box, we should have... Sorry about that, guys. Did not recognize I was covering the camera. We should have some more items. Well, obviously, we're going to have more items. But um, I made sure that all the items that I bought on bulk were brand new. Or at least that's what they were labeled, the boxes were. So... And like I said, I didn't really look at the manifest, but I can see that we got a lot of the same items. So I guess that's one downsize, or downside to uh, buying on line buying these things online instead of at actual liquidation warehouses 
And I know at the beginning of the video I said there wasn't one in my state, but um, now that I think about it, there is one, but it's like three hours. It's a three-hour drive. And, yeah. The prices may or may not be good. I don't know. I tried to contact them through Messenger to find out their prices and never got a response. So, there's that. All right, right away I see a lot of decent things. We have a humidifier filter here, probably about uh, 10 bucks. It's Honeywell, a decent brand. Um, we have a Crayola Color Wonder Mess Free Coloring Book, probably about a buck. Um, oh, this is interesting. This is all factory damage right here. This isn't even, or um, this is box damage. I mean, it's still brand new in the box. We have a Coleman brand LED light, looks like. Um, so, yeah, interesting. Should be about five, ten bucks there. Like I said, guys, this is my first time doing this, so these prices are most definitely going to be off. Um, is there something sparkly in here? Maybe, probably. We have more storage bins from Room Essentials, so I'm going to go ahead and get those out of the way because nobody really cares about those things, right? All right, let's see what else we got in here. What is this? This is a bueno, uh, like, you know, in Spanish for good. Uh, looks like a coffee cup. Appears to be brand new. It's got some glitter on it. I'm starting to wonder if there's something with glitter in here that's maybe busted open or something. Um, hope not. Like I said, I didn't look at the manifest. Uh, we have a rug here. Brand new rug, actually. Let's see how it looks. Sorry, I've got this laid out because we just did the flooring not too long ago. So, not a bad little rug. Maybe good for the bathroom or something. Alright, let's see about this. Um, wow, what is this? Some sort of bag, I guess. Alright, probably about like two bucks for that. Aha, uh -huh, we do. We have some glittery things in here. We have gold dust. Now, if only this was real gold, right? Looks like they had this on clearance for three twenty eight a pack. And it was originally 11 bucks. So maybe... Five dollars a piece, hopefully. About five bucks a piece. Um, Kumi Plum for a Kumi Creator. Um, I guess that's like a sewing machine for kids, maybe. Who knows, right? Looks maybe worth a little bit. Probably like five bucks. All right. Oh, now we've got some Loctite. Now this stuff right here usually goes for a decent little bit of money. They had this on clearance for a dollar ninety-four, and I can probably get about two or three bucks off of this bottle of Loctite alone. So, and I believe this was the one hundred something dollar case. Yeah, there's definitely glitter busted in this box somewhere. Um, we've got another one of these humidifier filters, so about another five to ten bucks. They're probably about seven dollars honestly is what we'll sell them for oh my god there is so much loctite right here look at this guys this is all loctite fun tech now this stuff right here easy 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 two or three dollars a pack i mean this stuff is actually worth a lot of money so one second let me get that all out here I mean, like i said there's a lot of duplicate items in here as you can tell look at all that Oh no! Our other humidifier looks like it possibly. Yeah, there's definitely something with glitter in here. I don't know if you guys can see all the glitter falling down, but I mean, it's crazy. Um, this was in there. So, yeah. There's three of those for about $10 a piece, most definitely. What do we got here? What is this? Oh my, yo, this is like a lamp of some sort? Hmm, looks like a, like one of those desk lamps that you can swivel to help read. It's got like a plug-in on it. Easy, easy, easy. Ten bucks for that. Oh boy. The glitter just gets worse as we delve into this box. So we got another gold dust add sparkle to paint. So that's what it is. It's painting, uh, painting supplies. 
So we've got one of those that are busted inside of this thing. Um, looks like we got another one of our Bueno cups here. I'm gonna have to wash everything off in here because of the glitter. Man, it's crazy. All right, what are these? Um, oh, these are some room essential. Um, looks like laundry bags or hampers. Uh, we might keep those for the house, honestly. Oh, what is this? Oh. Okay, so it's like a, it's a Fisker's Cultivator Hoe Comfort Handle. So it's going to be like for gardening. Probably five bucks. Alright, so this is the silver dust, right? So one of these things is busted in here. And whenever I find out which one it is, I'm going to have to throw it away, which sucks because that'll be a little loss of profit, but... Sometimes things happen that you can't control, and it looks like it may have been this one, actually. Maybe. Um, I'm not necessarily sure, because I don't, I don't see a hole anywhere on this. Oh, yes, I do, right there. Yeah, so this one right here is the one that split open and caused us all these problems. So, one second, I'm going to go through this way. Okay, cool. So we have so much here to go through today. Oh, wow. Hold up. Look at this. Two Lego bottles. Lego water bottles. Easy, easy $5 there. Kids tear up Lego these days. Lego is worth so much. I do know that much. An ever-ready LED light. Looks like a storm light. Hmm. Probably about, um, what, 5 10 bucks for that as well. Alright, let's see, what do we got here? Um, mold, moldable glue. So, three single use packs, maybe about five bucks. Uh, here's a box for the Bueno bottles. Interesting. Oh, Drano kitchen granules. Now, I know enough about Drano to know that this stuff is absolutely profitable. It melts grease, so this, I would say, is probably going to be with an open box, but the package inside still being sealed. The box is just a little damaged. Look at all the glitter on my hands. Oh, wow. Leave it to Bulk.com. My first experience to be a glitter bomb, right? Um, destroys tough, greasy kitchen clogs. Guaranteed or it's free. Well... I can sell this for probably about five, ten bucks, maybe. Probably somewhere around there. Um, just got another container. Now, unfortunately, since all the glitter decided to be inside of this thing, I'll have to wash these things out for sure. Frog tape keeps paint out, keeps lines sharp. Interesting. So, painter's tape, probably about three, four bucks. Uh, let's see. Threshold wide padded ironing board cover, 100% cotton cover. Probably about five bucks for that, maybe. Um, ooh, looks like we have a shower rod here. Decorative cafe rod, nope. But uh, nonetheless, probably about three bucks, four bucks for that. Oh my god, boys. What is. This is a Thermos product. One moment. <laughs> 